in five, four, three, two, one. You can hate him for not making that fight happen, but this is an unbiased show. We talk boxing. If it is just some missed details, the Double RT Boxing Show, Mr. A is here to help you, because that's what we do. We talk that boxing, spit that fire on the internet, dragging on the net, hashtag dragging on the net. You know, follow me on at Twitter at RRTB Show. Double RT, the Double RT, the Double RT Boxing Show with Mr. A. Ladies and gentlemen, it is I, Mr. A, and this is the Double RT Boxing Show. We're doing the post-fight recap for Jaime Munguia, blasting through the Canadian Brandon Cook. Now, like I said in the breakdown of predictions, you got to give Jaime Munguia the credit that he is putting forth that no other champion is. With this defeat of Brandon Cook, his second title defense in four months, we're having a hard time getting fighters to take three fights a year, let alone a champion making two defenses in four months. And against, now, whether you, how you rate his opponents is total irrelevant because he has to defend against top 15 opponents within that organization and he defeated number one and number three in a four month span that is some ridiculous shit you know you can almost make an argument he since May he could be fighter of the year you know the year is almost, you still got some time. He can, If he squeezes one more fight in, who, who else besides him has really done something? Really think about it. Fight of the year. You know, everyone's going to be thinking Spence, you, you know, Lomachenko, Crawford, uh, AJ Wilder. You know? As of right now, AJ didn't beat Pravec and Wilder and Fury ain't fighting. So, if any of those guys lose, Fury doesn't become fight of the year. Wilder, yeah, I don't know. Louise and Fury, but two title defenses in four months. He, could, like I said, I'm just putting it out there. Jaime McGee could be a front runner for fighter of the year. Because since May, two, two title defenses in four months against Number one and number three. That is some top-notch shit right there. Now, right here on the Double RT Boxing Show, this post-fight recap went kind of how we thought. Brandy was going to come to fight for his shield, be a fight and go out on his shield. But Jaime McGee was just too much for him. Blasted him around the ring. Had him stumbling. And, uh, I think he knocked him down second round. Finished him in his third. Just, just, just Brent. Brandon, he couldn't do it. He just could not withstand the onslaught. Harry McGee came out with a jab, came out with hooks, and Brandon Cook met him all with his face. Like, so, uh, I watched this fight. This, I watched this whole card. Uh, so Alvarez and Triple G. You know, I was at, I was at a nice little fight party, and. You know, the, the few that did make it early because of where start time, even they were like, whoa, dude, like, this, this is over. This guy's ridiculous. It's He hit him hard. He hit him often. And he goes out there to make all his shots count. It, like, it, it was no different wind-up, no different wrinkle in the Jaime McGill. He didn't pump out a jab more. He just, he was consistent with his pain. And... You know, we're going to have to see who else continues to... He, he took no punishment. He took no punishment. So I don't see why else Jaime McGee can't fight within the next two months. Keep keep his streak going. You know, August, why can't he be in the ring for November? Or at least December to close out a show. 
I don't know what Golden Boy pay per view or this Golden Boy card is going to be anyway. You know, throw him a, a headliner on Facebook Live. Who knows? But Jaime McGee is looking like a beast. He destroys Brandon Cook, beats him all around the ring. Is it? It's making it's making like Liam Smith like a fucker, like a soldier. Like, like damn, like Liam Smith was taking it too. Jaime McGee, may you know maybe maybe Liam Smith is gonna get some credit after the, at the end of this, you know. But you know, Saddam Ali brutally murdered. Liam Smith comes in, gives him a fight of a a good fight. Next one, Brandon Cook brutally murdered, you know. So Jaime McGee looks very successful. In three rounds, he just battered poor Brandon Cook all around. Beat the bad boy up real bad. This is Double RT Boxing Show. I'm your host, Mr. A. Thumbs up to you. Bring it on back to the show. Thank you for your time and support. Follow the show on Twitter at RRTV Show. At RRTV Show. Thanks a lot.